happy Tuesday, everybody. So you ever have a, um, a thought in your head and you're thinking to yourself, but then also when you when God confirms it, it like comes through like so clear. So I went to church this Sunday, right? So recently I have been praying and I have a little pet peeve. I hate to say that, but I do have a little pet peeve. So I have been recently praying and I've been asking God to help me to speak in tongues. I really did not know how to pray about it, but I know I said, I said, God, Holy Spirit, help me. You know, I was saying, Holy Spirit, you know, I want to speak in tongues. I want to be able to speak to God in a language that only he understands. I want to be able to have that over my life. I want to be able to feel what that feels like to be able to speak to God in that way, especially when I'm praying, when I'm praising God, right? So I go to church on Sunday. Oh, and I forgot to tell you, while I'm on my way to Myrtle Beach on vacation, I was praying in the car with my daughter, and I was just having, I was listening to a sermon, and I started praying. And while I was praying, it's like the Holy Spirit fell on me, and I started speaking in tongues in the middle of my prayer. I didn't know what I was saying, but it shocked me because I could feel myself speaking in tongues. And when I got done, of course, I was crying, but I told my daughter, I was like, oh, my goodness, I could not believe I was speaking in tongues. And I know that when you ask for God, ask God for things, he will give it to you. But when he does it, it's like he does it in a manner of you won't even know it it'll just fall on you it'll hit, hit you so i went to church on sunday and they were talking about um it was pentecost sunday and my daughter had just asked me mom what the pentecostal mean what does that mean and he was preaching from the book of acts chapter 2 verse 1 through 14 and i remember him going over what peter said i remember how he's talking about how the holy spirit fell on him in a church and everybody started speaking in different languages and it, the confusion and they were all on one accord and for some reason they thought the people were drunk they thought they had wine and it just was so much that i learned on sunday that i was thinking like it's so weird i was just in my prayer closet just asking god and asking the holy spirit and i spoke those words to help me speak in tongues and just to have a better relationship with god i know that i'm not perfect and i know that i fall short every day but i also know that i ask god to forgive me and I don't expect myself to walk in a manner as if I'm never going to fall. But when you do, just to know that God can always pick you up. And then this morning, I just felt like a different energy when I went to, I'm on my way to work. So I just got here. I just felt a different energy. And I just, I always feel this connection. And even when it relates to my prayers, it's like he answers my prayers. And it's like, I feel like a light has been activated in this last year over my life. And I don't know if it's because of the removal of things. It was like so many things clouded my vision and clouded my direction for the Lord. And I know that people will judge me and say, oh, well, you still do this, you still do that. Day by day, it's like little things are chipping off, things that I, I do that I don't feel the same energy towards. It's like a different um, it's like a different me. And I just want to speak to somebody out there to say, sometimes I remember speaking to some people and they said, oh, I just speak in tongues. It's not easy to do that. That's something you have to meditate. You have to study the word. You have to continuously, you know, just be in a position of expectancy and just continue to pray. And when somebody says like, oh, well, you know, I just speak in tongues. It just happened. That's not something that just happens. You have to be, I don't know what that is, but if that was something that just happens, that that would happen to anybody, everybody would be able to do it. I had to keep praying for it. I had to keep asking God, to, you know, to help me and ask the Holy Spirit to bless me to be able to do that. Because that's something I feel like a gift that the Holy Spirit gives you in order for you to communicate on a different level with God. And it's just amazing. So I just wanted to share that with somebody. And I want to say if you're praying for that and you're asking God to help you, it will come in time because I never thought that I would do it. And I don't even know. I do know I'll be able to do it again, but it's just something that fell on me and I can't, I don't even know how to do it. I just know it happened. So I just want to say that I hope everybody has a fantastic Tuesday. I pray the gift of prosperity, blessings, and also just progression on your job, whatever you're going through today, I pray that God just doubles it, multiplies whatever that you're trying to do. I pray that God grants it to you and gives you the best of everything because I know that sometimes it's hard when we go every day we keep pushing and sometimes you might not be where you want to be but it will happen and I just thank everybody for just listening and who ever came to my channel and needed to hear that it will come you will get it and have a blessed and wonderful day bye